Hey tweakers, what's going on? Ryan back at you from Tweak My Device. Um, I'm going to continue on with some mods to the Galaxy Nexus. This time I'm going to show you how to change these little soft keys down here at the bottom. I've shown you how to add the search button, how to add uh, these hidden menu buttons. And so now we're going to change the look of these completely. And the awesome thing is there's a lot of them to choose from. Check the link in the description below this video. And let's give a thanks to Atticus182 on XDA. Um, he has posted this thread. And you will find just about any style you want. Um, I've had these before and they've looked really good. And I'm actually about to flash these airbrushed ones and uh, try those out. Many different colors, styles, a couple of different types of font. Any gothic chicks uh, watching out there, this looks pretty cool. This might go for your theme. We've got a standard looking uh, like Windows home theme there. I'm on a boat, if you're just totally lost. This looks pretty cool, the grunge reflection. So basically you find one you want and you can either download it from your phone. You can actually do all of this from your Galaxy Nexus. A PC is not required. Uh, but if you want to download it from your PC, just click. And there's a huge directory here of all different kinds that you can check out. Once you have the one you want on your phone, we will continue with the device. Now on our Nexus, we're going to go to the market. And we're going to search for Zip Themer. Good, it's a free app. Let's grab that. Go ahead and open it. We're going to do this. Just go ahead and click OK. So more than likely this is your first time using this app. Hit the menu button and we're going to select Update Edify. Now select Browse. And this is where we want to choose a zip file that we flashed on the device before. Um, preferably the ROM that you're running. So I'm currently on the AOKP Toro Build 19. I'm going to select that one. Now we're going to choose Configure. And we have a tiny little success message down at the bottom. Now we'll hit the back button to go back to the main screen. Now let's select our theme. And this is where the file is on our device. So I'm going to go back to my main storage card directory. And here's my file right down here, Soft Keys Airbrush. So I'm going to select that. Now let's build it. Do some work. You definitely want an undo zip in case things go bad. Then you can flash back and get back to the way you are now. Great. Our log looks good. No error messages. Now we can get out of this and we're going to get into recovery. And this is how I do it on the Galaxy Nexus. I use the touch base recovery. Now I've already done a backup, a complete Android backup, but that's always recommended when you're doing anything like this. But we're just going to go to install zip, choose it. And that's the one right there, soft keys airbrush blue update. You can see the undo file is right above it in case we get into trouble. Press enter, and yes. Really quick, it's a small file. We're going to go back and reboot. Now that we're back up and running, you can see these soft keys, and these are pretty sick. I like them. They look really awesome. It gives a neat little artistic element to the phone. And they do rotate correctly with landscape. So that's it. Using Zip Themer to change these soft keys on your Galaxy Nexus to anything you want them to be. 
You can flash a different one every day if you want to. Have fun with the soft key mods and subscribe to Tweak My Device on YouTube.